Well, this is Pat Walker, Mission Winners, doing a training, coaching, educational video for everybody. I've been doing this since 1986, managed money, and just want to put some things in perspective. I know the market's down 700 points, and it's like it looks like the end of the world. Just put it in perspective. For this to be anything like the, the decline, the crash of 1987, we'd have to be down about 6,000 points today. Okay, 6,000. So I'm not trying to minimize this decline, but I just like to put things in perspective. All right, it's very important. A lot of people are looking at this volatility and going, oh man, this is really bad. This is it, it's over, there's nothing to do. You know, this is dropping, it's, it's done. Here's a cold hard fact for you. Bull markets have not been outlawed. I am not the eternal bull. I am not saying this market is going to rally today, tomorrow, this week. I'm not saying that at all. But eventually, the volatility will settle down and it will lead to a good advance. It always has and it always will. That's a fact. So we're looking here at, we're going to look at a couple examples. What am I talking about? We can look at Amazon and say, this is the end of the world. Look at this drop. Look at this waterfall. All right. Well, it had a pretty hard decline right here too, didn't it? See that? That's a pretty hard decline, folks. But then it rallied, and then it formed a higher low, and then it made a nice advance. Here it is again. This low is slightly above this low. I'm not saying the higher low is going to stick. The key point is this, something to rem remember. Eventually, the volatility dissipates, price action settles down, and it leads to good opportunities. And what's our job? Protect capital right now. And team, and this is for everybody, there are two forms of capital in the markets. There is financial capital, we all know that, there's also mental or emotional capital. We need to protect both. We do that with our tactics and our disciplines. At times, we just sit and we wait. Eventually, this will rally. When? I don't know. From what level? I don't know. Nobody knows the future, but eventually, it will. Here's another example. Google. Look at this drop here. Look at this decline. Good Lord, that's awful. Then it falls, rallies, and then it falls again, and rallies. And you get a higher low here, and it makes a pretty good march, folks. That's a pretty good 300 point run that it made through here. Okay? And here it is today. And what do you see? A potential. I'm not saying it's going to stick. A higher low. This low is higher than this low. It whips around. Maybe it'll eventually settle down. I don't know the future again, but more times than not, and I've looked at charts since 1986 and managed money, you see things in there and you pick up on it and it helps us make money. The key to the point, the moral of the story is this. Eventually, the dust will settle, okay? And this will perform with a nice rally. From what level? Again, I don't know, and I'm not forecasting. But do know this. Bull markets haven't been outlawed, all right? I'm not saying again that we're going to rally today. I'm not saying we're going to rally tomorrow. I'm not saying we're going to rally this week. But we will settle down again. And what's our job? And I want you to look at this one too, Tesla. Now, they have all kinds of news going on here. But right now, they have a higher low. They had a higher low right here. Notice how it settled down? Look at this. Look at that decline. It's the end of the world. And then it rallies, and then it falls, and you get a higher low, and we were buying here and here. Suppose you're buying it for $800 a share. 800 over under 1,100? That's 300 points with no work. Is it going to do it again? I don't know. I don't know. But eventually, again, the action settles down and a new trend will form. It happened in 1987. It happened all through time. So what's our job right now? To maintain composure, to maintain a positive attitude, not a euphoric attitude, not giddy, a controlled attitude, a settled attitude. 
It's like the quote, only a confused mind always says no. All right? No. We know what to look for. You know what to look for. That's why I started Mission Winners, is to show people, illustrate to people what to look for. We take a breath. We maintain composure. We know what to look for. We know what to look for in the charts. And we have the patience and the discipline to wait for it. Thank you for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit like. Maybe hit that subscribe button. We come up with new content nearly every day. Also, check out the videos on the right. YouTube recommends the one on the top, and the bottom one is something we thought you might enjoy. See you next time.